Hey, what's going on guys? It's CJ. So we have a leather couch and we've had it for a long time. It's actually really strong and durable, but over time you can see the color has faded and we're looking up how to restore this back to new, basically like this one. So this we actually did ourselves, and you can do the same thing too. All right, so you're gonna go to the website called myshoesupplies.com. I'll put the link in the description and you're gonna to wanna to buy the spray paint that you need. It's about $15 a can. In this case, we bought a couple different colors. We have coffee, we have coffee, russet, and then we also have dark brown. So you're gonna buy these once you have these. You can do this in your house, but if you're gonna do it in your house, you wanna put down some tarping, some kind of rug or carpet because this is spray paint. It will spray your floor, whatever color. So. You know, I would recommend I would recommend you do this outside if you can. But if you can, in this situation with the couches being so big, um, we're having the windows open. You know, put down any kind of rug, carpet, your floor, so you don't get spray paint on your floor. Open all windows. Keep children and pets away from this while you're doing it. Wear masks, and gloves, and goggles, so you don't get fumes in your eyes. And you're not breathing this stuff in. So when you do this, you want to spray about 12 inches away and you're just going to do little spurts of one color at a time. You're going to let it dry and then you're going to hit it again with the next color and then the next color. So we have three different colors. So my wife is going to do this over here on this side and she's going to start here. So just little spurts about 12 inches away from the couch. This is coffee right now. You do want to clean the couches, get any hairs off that you have, anything on the couch, just wipe them. If you have a fan, turn the fan on in the, in the room that you're doing this in. You just want to get all the fumes out as much as you can. I really don't recommend doing it inside, but we, in our situation, these couches are humongous and we took them through the front door and it's just, it's too much work to take it outside. We only took this one outside because of how skinny it is, but you can see the difference is that the leather itself is not really torn. It's just the front top and the front layer is just spray painted. It's just a coating. It's not the actual leather. See this, how it's done. You can see the scratches from the dogs. This isn't going to repair your scratches. It may, you know, help seal it in a little bit, but this is more or less going to restore the color of the furniture. Dries side. pretty fast. And you're doing it so light and so far away. So now we're going to do russet. All right. Just going to do russet. Let that dry for a few minutes. You can already see that the color is starting to come back. I mean, yeah. it's, it's amazing how compared, quickly the color. Compared to two chairs next to each other. So we did uh, a coat of the coffee, a coat of the russet, then we'll do a coat of the dark brown. And then, uh, so wherever areas are looking like it's still light, that's where you're going to hit it with another color. You just want to work it in slowly. You don't want to overload it, you know, with one color. Just mix them all in together, different colors, one at a time. And then um, also, sometimes in the end, after you do the dark brown, when you notice some spots, you might, you know, have to go back and start the process over with some in certain areas with the coffee, the russet, and the dark brown. So, um, but after you do the general, um, then you can see, you know, what you need. And then just it does dry quick, but I would say let it sit for a couple hours so no you know no Before dogs or sits anybody it. sits on it, just let it fully dry and you'll be good to go. And like I said, it's gonna come out like you're like you bought it brand new. It's just amazing. Again with the scratches, that's not something this is gonna take care of. So you can also purchase a, this is on Amazon, you can purchase a kit for a lot on um, cleaning and conditioning and then there's also um, a polish so that can help with scratches and these both I bought on Amazon. So Lexol leather. So we haven't tried the polish yet but this is something we're going to try out as well. Once all the spray paint dries we're going to uh, go ahead and go with this stuff so hopefully it'll take care of the scratches. And there we go. There is the final coating, the final touch of the couches. Looks beautiful. Way better than what it was before. 
Thanks to my wife. Like, subscribe, and comment, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.